Next on Eyewitness News at 6, a shocking shooting in San Gabriel leaves two people uh, wounded. Investigators now working to find out what sparked this violent encounter. Plus, we're learning new details about a potentially explosive situation in Diamond Bar. What investigators are saying about a car crash that ruptured a natural gas line. And it's the end of an era. Marie Callender's flagship restaurant location mm -hmm. on the Miracle Mile closes its doors for the final time. Eyewitness News at 6 is next. Mathis Brothers is the only place where you can shop top designer brands in stock at everyday low prices. Right now, you can get this classic linen Chesterfield sofa with silver nail head trim for just $9.98. You'd expect to pay twice as much at other retailers, but at Mathis Brothers, it's just $9.98. It's one of hundreds of sofas in stock ready to take home today. You can also take advantage of our free design service and let our style advisors help you create the room of your dreams only at Mathis Brothers. Human weather, I'll have it full forecast Monday morning. From the KBC 7, this is Eyewitness News. A teenager driver steps on the accelerator instead of the brake, crashing into a home in Diamond Bar, rupturing a gas line and forcing evacuations. Hello, I'm Veronica Miracle, in for Giovanna Lara. And I'm Julie Rand. Here's the latest at 6. A neighbor says his son caused the accident crashing into the side of a home and rupturing the gas line. The gas expected to be restored at any moment now. I would news reporter Amy Powell is live in Diamond Bar with all the latest details. Amy. And Jewelry, just a few moments ago, I spoke to a resident who told me it may actually be several days before the gas is turned back on at the unit that was impacted by the crash. Now, this all happened this morning. Neighbors say there was a very strong smell of gas in the neighborhood, and this was all started by an unfortunate accident.